Thanks, guys. We're going to get started with the questions now. Hello and a warm welcome to a stadium that always oozes passion, St. James's Park. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Newcastle United up against Tottenham Hotspur. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Newcastle in a potentially dangerous position and credit is due for that good piece of defending. Well, for Newcastle United, it really was a fine performance and a magnificent result in the last game against Wolverhampton Wanderers. How do you anticipate it going this time, Stuart? 
That away victory was a really good performance. However, I can't see a repeat of that result today. I've got a feeling they're going to struggle in midfield and ultimately lose the game. Well, it's impossible to escape the conclusion that Harry Kane is just a thorough professional. Stuart, what do you anticipate seeing from him today? Well, he's been in fine form in the league, as you can see from those stats. And it's going to be a real test for that back line to keep him quiet. If they switch off, even for a minute, they'll be punished. Reguilon. Son. And far from the ideal cross. Keeper's ball all the way. Shelby. Ryan Grafenberg. And successfully cut out. And as a play it goes, throw in coming up here. And Spurs doing well to win it back. Reguilon. Now with Delhi. And a fine tackle. Couldn't hang on to the ball. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? Oh, he's through here. Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping. And there's the delivery. Any goalkeeper would accept corner kick deliveries like that every day. The possession lost, intercepted. Kane. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. Shelby. Grafenberg. Oh, he's given the ball away. Perfect example of how to execute a slide tackle. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Teammate and support. Determined defending. Emerson. Ndombele. And that was a very fine read. And a long way out here. But the goalkeeper didn't have to work quite as hard as I thought he might initially. Emerson. Well, as you can see, Spurs have completely controlled the possession. But in terms of creating chances, they've been well below their normal standards. Unless that changes quickly, it's going to be a really frustrating day for them. Oh, wait, Stuart, they might score. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Let's see about the delivery. Simple for the keeper. Well, the clearance, half-hearted. And I think the threat has been averted. Ayala in possession. Shelby. Well, brilliant work to keep that one in play. Well, nothing for the players in the middle to work with. Reguilon. Now Harry Kane. Delhi. An awful lot of green space to run into. He'll take the lead. Are back underway and 1 0 it is. Let's see what happens next. And so it is the first half story. So the second half underway, with Spurs looking to build upon a largely positive first-half performance. Opportunity in the wide area. 
Emerson. Lucas Mora has someone to play it to. They've gone and scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back. Well, a second goal for them here. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Now, will the cross work out for them? The clearance wasn't decisive. Well, nothing untoward happened. But a goal to let you know about in the City game. Alex Scott has the information for us. It's a goal for Manchester City. They're the first on the score sheet here with 53 minutes played. I don't know what was said at half-time, Derek, but it has certainly worked. Thanks as always, Alex. Kane. And here's Dombele. Firing it towards goal. It'll close down straight away. Bodies forward and the break looks on. And let's give credit to the defending. Well, this is the home of live football, EA TV. And we have more action coming up from the Premier League for you. It's Newcastle United facing Tottenham Hotspur. Ayala in possession. Might really be able to trouble them here. Ayala has it. Well, just the tackle that was needed. Ndombele. Kane. Emerson. Getting in there to intercept. Shelby. Newcastle in a potentially dangerous position. Ayala has it. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Well, as you can see, Spurs have completely controlled the possession. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. And he smacks it against the crossbar. Well, I thought that was in, Derek. He struck it so sweetly. Plenty of power. Can't come much closer than that. And a change for Spurs at this juncture. Josko Guardiol. Shelby. He's beaten his man. And moving the ball nicely. Clattered away. Right, time to switch it over to the Etihad where there's been a goal. And that means we join Alex Scott. It's a goal from Manchester City. The defender was caught in possession just before the goal. He won't want to be watching that back. They're pulled ahead by two with 72 minutes played. Many thanks as ever, Alex. Lo Celso. And given the defender's touch, the referee says corner. the delivery well that header was never going to be problematic for the goalkeeper a good and fair challenge wonderful chance well, I'm afraid it goes down as a wasted opportunity. Well, no excuses. He should have scored there, and the goalkeeper got really lucky. He can't believe it. Lo Celso. Superb block. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. And a goalkeeper on top of his game. Well, it's great goalkeeping. What a big save that is. Over it comes. And not a header that was ever really going to trouble the goalkeeper.
Trippier. Grafenberg. Now he must favour the cross. Could be threatening. And an astute piece of defending. Well, not far away from full time. But really, you've got to say, Stuart, disappointing from a Newcastle perspective. Well, they've had no defensive game plan today. The forwards haven't pressed the ball. The midfield players have been outnumbered. And there is too much space between the defenders at the back. That Oh, just wide of the mark. Goal kick. Well, that never looked like troubling the keeper, did it? But it was worth an effort. A good strike from him. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. Romero. Lucas with it. So the final whistle and no cause for celebration in the Magpies' camp. We've got some questions for you.